What is happening guys? It is Tuesday and we are at the Hack and Pack Shop and I know you guys are waiting for your house to videos on this but I haven't even done anything with it since the last video. I had this come in for a little bit of a bumper repair. It had a couple nasty freaking rips in her. But it's all better now. Oh yeah. Alright, so uh, this video. Um, a couple of you had mentioned the uh, rust repair panel or that, um, that panel we were doing the experiment on with uh, the etch primer and the lacquer primer and a little bit of paint and what primer does over rust and what it doesn't over rust and bare steel, clean steel, blah, blah, blah. Let's go outside. Because honestly, I forgot about the son of a bitch. And it's been laying in water now for at least a month. So let's see if we got any progress. Super bug. Got my black rams. All right. Let's see what we got here. Put her up here on top of the snow plow. Maybe it'll balance. Okay. <clears throat> this is the rust fix. Just that spray can rust fix stuff. Okay over rusty steel this is the rust fix in the base coat clear coat which i used a spray can guys i didn't use uh regular automotive finish on this base clear over untreated steel just straight up etch primer over rusty steel etch primer base clear over rusty steel okay so rust fix rust fix etch primer etch primer base coat clear coat etch primer over clean steel etch primer base and clear over clean steel now if you look at this um, it looks like just the etch primer alone didn't work here okay but with a little bit of paint on it it did help it out okay now on this one we have etch primer and lacquer primer over clean steel and then we have etch primer, lacquer primer, and base clear over clean steel. This is only lacquer primer over clean steel. It looks like maybe it's doing a little something there. And this is lacquer primer and base coat over clean steel. So here we have the etch. So we have actually four different products here. We have etch primer, lacquer primer, base coat, clear coat. Here we have three. Lacquer primer, base coat, clear coat. Here we have one product, which is just lacquer primer, and here we have two products, which is etch coat and lacquer primer. So it actually looks like that the etch isn't working quite as well as the lacquer, but I'm not sure. And then right here, this was just clean steel with no protection on it, and this is clean steel with just paint over it. Okay, there's a little bit of ice here, it's cold. So, so far, it looks like the best gig we got going on is the etch, the lacquer primer, base, and clear. So four different products over this area, okay? And it looks like even just the etch and the lacquer primer, it looks like those two work pretty good together, okay? So I just wanted to do an update for you guys on this panel, okay? Hopefully you can read all this. It's starting to get dark out here. And I'm not going to run this through a flash converter so you guys will get whatever quality out of this camera you're getting here. Alright, so there is our update. I know it's been a couple months since we put this thing on video right there in the muddy shit. Alright guys, well we'll call that it for this video. Y'all have a goody goody. Hopefully tomorrow night I'll have the uh, how-tos on the uh, Silverado starting up for you.